Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton. I'm here at Apex 2017 in San Diego and I'm joined by Chris LaRocca from Mechel. Chris, thanks for joining me. Um, I've been hearing about some new products that you've got in the marketplace that mm -hmm. specifically are coming from the Mechel brand. Tell me where you're going with that. What's, what's new and what's led you to that development? Well, that's great. So actually yesterday we announced a revolutionary new product for our Metcal division. It's called Connection Validation and it's our hand soldering line. Um, the reason that that product is so revolutionary, we actually think it's disruptive technology, is it provides real-time feedback to the operator of that hand soldering system when they've got a good intermetallic connection in the solder joint, basically okay. when they have a good solder connection. Currently, an operator is left with a visual inspection. They mm. put the iron down on the joint, they put a little solder there. When it looks like they've got good contact, they move on to the next joint. We developed some technology, actually back in 2009, that provides an algorithm and a feedback loop to the power supply that measures the IMC, the intermetallic connection, uh, and allows the operator to know when they've got a good solder joint. So okay. it takes the risk mitigation out of the production aspect when you're soldering to make sure that you've got good solder connection. Yeah, and you know, it's interesting. We're constantly talking about about data at the moment and how that data is used to improve process mm -hmm. and to work backwards and forwards, industry 4.0, IOM, yep. whatever you call it, and trying to get down to as narrow a piece of information as possible. Yep. This is right down to solder joint. What about what about the traceability element of that? What about the data where you're actually measuring that? Is that able to be collected in some way? Absolutely. So this connection validation platform that we now have currently has a USB port on it. There's full traceability on that and you can actually get that data in real time. So as an operator is soldering on a board, you can see for that operator, that line, that station, whatever it might be, did they get a good solder connection? Was there a validation that they had good IMC on that mm -hmm. board, on that particular joint? Was there a, a temperature issue? Was there an ESD issue? All of that data okay. is tracked, not only at the board level, but through the solder tip. There's a chip in our cartridge now that connects all that. <coughs> and as you look at this connection validation, I call it a platform, because we are evolving that type of system into not only a robot, platform, but also, as you talked earlier, uh, Industrial 4.0, yeah. the Internet of Things. So you'll have full connectivity on these systems. So imagine an entire contract manufacturer in EDM where they've got 500 or so of these systems. These dumb tools that sit on a bench, yeah. that all they do is solder, will now have connectivity and will provide real-time data to a production supervisor, a process control engineer, where they can either see in real-time production or in hindsight go back and trace a particular board to make sure that there wasn't in fact a solder issue yeah. on that particular application. Yeah. And to get some real valuable information, like basically the profile that has been used to, to solder that, the solder paste information, all that data. Last question. What led you here in terms of demand and, and how's the response been in the in the short two-day window that you launched? Well, the response has been overwhelming. Now, we have had units in the field for about a year. We identified about a dozen end users that we felt could really benefit from this type of technology. So they've been using the product for quite a while. You can Google search and, and look about how many product recalls have occurred out there because yeah. of faulty solder connections. So the, pro the problem is real. Yeah. And what we're trying to do is develop a system around risk mitigation, mm -hmm. basically allowing a user to put a system into place that's going to take out or at least start to minimize the risk of having a faulty solder connection through your production process. We started looking at this and said, how do we, how do we offer a product that <coughs> we can roll out to our entire product yeah. line? Originally, we were going to develop a system just for high value connections, mm -hmm. military defense, aerospace, medical, somewhere where some, an application where a user might pay a premium for that. And what ultimately we decided to do was to take this incremental cost mm -hmm. that was going to be put into this standard, into this separate line, and move it into our standard product offering. So now when we go to market, this feature set will be in our standard yeah. soldering product line. So we're hoping to take price out of the equation and allow a user to look at our competitive systems and say all things yeah. being equal, this one has connection validation technology, the others don't. It should be a very easy buying decision for the customer. That absolutely should be and I I'd, I'd like the way you've approached that because my feeling is that although it might have been the automotive or the medical or the aero industries that originally wanted that, mm -hmm. it feels much more like particularly contract manufacturers want the solution across the board. They want traceability and if it's a byproduct, it's it's great news for another benefit. So Absolutely. Really We've had customers that will say, it, for them, this is a real value because what they've been seeing on their production line is, you can look at a board top and bottom, 
Yep. And that solder connection looks good, but when you cross section it, you've got empty barrel fill. Yeah. So while your standard process looks like you're getting good IMC <laughs> formation, yeah. in reality you're not. And what connection validation does is it ensures that the operator on that joint is soldering long yeah. enough or using enough solder to get a solid solder connection. That's really the value proposition that connection yeah. validation brings. And give them feedback so they can do a better job Full as well. Full traceability, so it's, it's, absolutely. It's that complete closed loop. Yeah. Chris, fantastic stuff. Thanks for stopping by to chat and enjoy the rest of the show. Philip, always good to see you. Thanks. Thank you.